Our workbook lesson today, if you follow along day by day, is I can elect to change all thoughts that hurt. You can do that. You actually can do that with everything. You can all elect to change all thoughts that hurt. Doesn't that seem so intuitively helpful to know that if, if you had the power to believe in them, you must have the power to, to let them go or to not believe in them anymore. You, you can reverse whatever seemed to go on and, and you don't even have to be concerned about how long it took to become so seduced with these dark thoughts, you, you don't even care how long it took to get this way. You just want to be free of it. You want to come to freedom. And you come to freedom by letting go of those hurtful thoughts, attack thoughts, judgments, grievances. There's just no point in holding on to grievances when they're taking away your precious peace of mind, which is natural. You know, you, there's no point in hanging on to those anymore. And admittedly, this takes uh, practice. You know, I know for myself, I came across A Course in Miracles in 1986, and then it was euphoric, and, and it was huge. It, was a, it made a huge impact on me, but I knew that I had to really give it my dedication for that almost, I'll say, slow and steady clearing and cleaning of the mind, unwinding. If the ego wound me in, I want to be unwound and I'm, I'm not going to even judge the process of unwinding. I'm, I just want to go for it and, and, and go for that experience with all my heart. And that's all I'm encouraging you to do, not to try to think you have to somehow force yourself to wake up. <laughs>